in 1956, in Oloibiri, West Africa, Nigeria, specifically the Niger Delta region, oil was found and the discovery of oil led to an economic boost to the country. Foreign investment also improved. However, this oil boost warranted a huge environmental degradation to the host communities where the oil was found. As you can see, the first picture from a green picture went into a black picture. To tackle the environmental degradation, the two first agencies were found, Nestra and Nostra. Nestra is the National Enforcement Standard Regulation and Enforcement Agency, which is the main agency of enforcement in Nigeria to protect the environment. Nostra responds to oil spill. These two agencies were formed to join the Department of Petroleum Resources and the courts to tackle the problem. However, the problem still persists and environmental degradation remains the order of the day in the Niger Delta region. My name is Okwanu Zawamaka. I'm a research student in the Law School of Robert Goddard University, Aberdeen. And my research aims to explore the six findings that my literature review has founded and to explore these six uh, 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 findings, I'm going to be using a qualitative methodology and an interpretivist philosophy to show that there's environmental degradation in the Niger Delta as a result of the activities of the oil and gas industry. My research is going to assess the effects of the removal of the oil and gas sector from the enforcement grip of NEJRA. It is very important to realize that NEJRA, which is the main enforcement agency of Nigeria, does not have power over the industry that data and statistics have shown to be the major polluter of the Nigerian environment. My research is going to analyze the impacts of an independent measure from the primary Ministry of Environment. And my research is going to examine the role of the courts. Regulations are only as good as their enforcement. You can have regulations, but without enforcement and compliance, the regulations amount to no good. At the end of the day, my research aims to be a template for a more efficient and effective enforcement of environmental laws in the oil and gas industry in Nigeria, where we can all breathe clean and fresh air once again before the discovery of oil. Thank you.